20% increase. I always wanted a thing called tuna sashimi. Hey guys, tuna back. Um, this time is the Hudson Summer Carnival, uh, 1986. This is the original Star Soldier game on the Famicom. Let's turn to you a bit. Um, it's not a bad game. It's a pretty good shoot. It's a bit like Star Force, but um, it's got a weird mechanic. But if you push forward or back as you're going past some of the scene, you fly underneath it, which is a bit weird. I don't quite get it, but. Uh, We'll give it a go. I'll say that unfortunately this one is one of those ones that doesn't have a two minute mode. But uh, we'll give it a try and I'll stick a time on and then we'll see where that lands. Right, here we go. Run number one. I'll tell you this was the second game. It was the first Star Force game but it was the second game of the Summer Carnival. See what I mean about flying in the background? It's very strange. But there's your head in a bit, so you've got to shoot something, and all of a sudden you can push forward. You fly underneath that uh, piece of level. It's keep collecting those power ups. You go a lot faster when you pick it up, it's weird, but uh, keep collecting, you get the sort of multi-directional fire like you do in the other Star Soldier games. And all the music goes a bit uh, over the top. Right. With this thing... Oh. Damn, I went underneath the background then. It's like, uh, if you stay in the middle over there... If you stay in the middle there, you can get a nice £80,000 bonus by uh, killing it. There's my head in with the pushing in the background, it's really strange. It's quite cool for an S game, won't it? My score on my first run. So I'll just restart the machine a minute. Right, run number two. Hopefully, I can try and get that bonus this time. This game gets pretty hard later on as well. I managed to get around about seven times, about the seventh level, roughly, I think it is. But, uh, oops. It starts to get pretty difficult quick. See, push forward then, and I'll use the background. Really annoying. I tell you, without that mechanic, this game would have been really good. Ah, I missed it. Damn. Say these bonuses like I just had shot today, but. As I went underneath the background and now you may I couldn't do anything about it. Yeah. It's 
same as them if you shoot them at the same time. I haven't done it, but I'm assuming you get a bonus as well. Right, that's my two minutes up. So one more run. underneath the background is so annoying. So one annoying thing about this game, I'm glad they cut it out for the uh, the other Star Soldiers games. I'm glad they got rid of it. It's a very strange tactic. I don't particularly like much. Just makes you not want to actually go forward to get anything up. This is strange. That is, yeah, now I've got the, the big fine, the music's changed. This fine's actually really good. Oh, I see one touch of that. I do anything there either. I really don't like that going underneath the background thing. It's frustrating. Should be just to fly straight up to him there, position yourself, and off we go. But no, what happens? You fly underneath the background, and you get killed. It's just like that. Two minutes up. Say so that's uh, Star Soldier, the original version on the um, Famicom. Uh, this was the 1986 uh, Summer Carnival game.